Hello, you've guessed it. It is Sunglasses Day on the 1st of May 2020 and day 42 of the Mindfulness Challenge. My name is Julian Jenkins and you know that already probably unless you're watching for the first time. If you're watching for the first time you need to go back to day one and start all over again. You don't really. This is about us working on certain bits and pieces in during a very difficult and challenging time through the coronavirus. <clears throat> and you may see when you go back through these things that how my life has changed, how my health has changed, how everything is changing, but we're adapting and we're learning to relax, we're learning to accept, we're learning to break habits and we're learning to be happy. And guess what day 42 is about? Relaxing, accepting, breaking habits and learning to be happy. The meditation we're going to do is where we welcome the opportunity to do all of the things I just said. And this meditation is key for you today and for you tomorrow and for you over the weekend to relax, accept, move forward, break habits, learn and to be happy. And the reason I've got the sunglasses on again today is because today's a happy day. The sun is shining, even if it's not shining, it's shining in my heart. Is your heart shining? I hope so. <clears throat> did you wake up this morning and say, good morning, Julian, I love you. Good morning, Julian, I love you. Or did you just get up out of bed and thought, oh God, here we go again. How am I going to do today? And oh, I got to do this today and I got to do that today. There's always somebody worse off than yourself, no matter what situation or experience or where you are. And I want to say at this stage as well, if you are a key line worker, front line worker, key worker, and you've done some amazing things, which you all are doing on a daily and hour, minute by minute basis. Thank you very much. Also, thank you very much for everybody who has stayed at home because you've played your part as well. So everybody, little virtual clap here. So if you can just have 10 seconds of clapping, please start clapping. Show an appreciation and gratitude for you because you've stayed in, you've made the difference and for those people who are making a difference in the big wide world outside. Today we're going to get straight into a guided meditation about being happy, relaxing, accepting and learning and breaking habits. It's quite a long meditation but I'm sure you enjoy that anyway. So join with me now and I'm going to put a picture up. People say to me why do you click your fingers? I click my fingers so when I'm editing I can clearly see the spike and I know that's what I got to put my picture. Right, the picture is up and we're going to go into a meditation. I'm just going to get myself comfortable and I want you to get comfortable. Find a comfortable place where you can lay down, where you're not going to be disturbed by anyone or anything for a duration um, while we do this, through this recording. So you want to be relaxed, uh, happy, accepting, breaking habits and learning new things. And in order to do this, you must become relaxed and then focus on what is it is that you really want and what you really need at the moment. It's up to you really to dedicate the time and make the necessary efforts towards your goals. I say a lot, but there is no magic wand in all of this. Julian Jenkins doesn't have the God-given ability to heal you within a split second. What we do have though, and what I need you to say to yourself, is I intend to relax, be accepting of life as it comes, break bad habits and create new helpful ones and be opening to learning new things always and be genuinely happy. Now as you're sitting there and you're breathing in and you're breathing out, that's a big statement, but it's one we're going to be able to, through cultivation and practicing is what we grow, is be able to say to yourself, I intend to relax, be accepting of life as it comes, break bad habits and create new helpful ones and be open to learning new things always and being genuinely happy. Now be in this gentle, com comfortable position and, and hopefully we're not going to be disturbed. But if we are, we still have the ability to just hear the noises, you know, be with ourselves. And if emotions come in, just accept them, breathe them and let them go. We're all working in our household environments. So there may be noises of dogs or children or doors. If you do hear any of this, just hear it, accept it, breathe it and let it go.
Relaxing for me is quite easy. What I like to do is take five deep breaths. And we're going to do that together to oxygenate, oxygenate our body systems. So I want you to inhale and exhale slowly. No problem. Inhale and exhale. Let it go. Breathe in and out. Breathing fully in and just let the air escape, oxygenate in your whole body. Now, when you're in your mind's eye, just feel let your eyes wander around, looking at things that are around you with your eyes closed. You can see a room and without looking too long at anything in particular and without any effort. Allow your mind to choose something in front of you in your mind's eye. Something to focus on. Do not look away. And in your mind's eye, I want you to continue to stay at this spot. In your eye, mind's eye, you can see these things. And we're going to gently and calmly relax ourselves with our eyes closed. The pictures bring this object to mind. Continue to stay at the spot. And I'm going to count down. And every time I count down, you'll feel yourself with your eyes closed, bringing to mind this object and becoming more and more relaxed. Ten. More and more relaxed. Nine. Safe and secure and comfortable. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four, three, feeling very relaxed. Two, even more so. One, and zero. And as you get to zero, you have this thing in your mind's eye, but what you feel, sense around you is a complete wave of relaxation. It just sweeps all over you from your head to your toes. Now I want you to let your focus move down from your eyes. Just notice how your eyes feel and ask them to relax even more. The little movement in your eyes at this time could be rapid eye movement and it's completely normal. These small eye movements allow you to feel calm. And notice the back of your head. How does it feel against any of the surfaces touching it? How heavy does your head feel right now? And let your focus move to your nose and feel the slight sensations of air moving in and moving out with every breath. And when you breathe in, imagine that you're being filled with complete calmness. And when you breathe out, imagine your body feels heavy and deeply relaxed. You're doing very good. Focus on your ears. Notice how they feel and what you hear around you. Try to push your awareness here and try to hear every single noise. And when sounds come into your ears, they act as little waves of relaxation, taking you even deeper. Notice the sound of my voice and how soothing it is. From here forward, you can only hear my voice guiding you. All of the sounds passing through only take you deeper into a state of calmness. And I want you to focus now on your mouth. How does that feel? And what do you notice? Can you feel a wetness on your lips? Perhaps you can imagine biting into a fresh slice of an apple and you notice how your mouth waters, the tastes, the textures. And move your focus now down to your neck and if there's any tension, just release it a little more. Might just give it a little movement side to side and notice how your neck feels right now and just feel all the sensations in your neck as it slowly 
softens and relaxes. And focus on your shoulders and move your attention slowly going down each arm, down all the way to each of your fingertips. What are your fingertips touching right now? Feel the sensations with them. And allow your focus to go to your chest, relax in this area as well as your upper back. And if you notice any tension here, just ask it to nicely release, just a little. Imagine you're now focusing on your heart and feeling it beat strongly, supporting you. Relax your heart and just give it that loving kindness. And as you do, notice how good it feels to do so. Focus on your lungs and feel them gently expanding and contracting with your breath, delivering oxygen to your body. And also allow your focus to move down to your vital organs and your digestive system. Just notice your belly and how it feels. Just observe it working and digesting effortlessly for you. And I want you to Notice your lower back and how it is pressing against the surface you're on. And if you feel any tension, just say, please relax just a little bit more. As you feel all your muscles softening. Turn your attention to your pelvis and your hips. And notice any sensations that you have there. And this takes you deeper and deeper into a state of complete relaxation. Allow your focus to move down each leg, slowly relaxing those as well. Your legs have been working hard. They've been taking you to so many places over the years and they deserve to fully relax. And notice this wonderful wave of relaxation moving down to your knees and down to your lower legs, all the way to your feet and to the very tip of each toe. And I want us to take our focus now back up the body, the same way we come. But this time, imagine through your toes, you're slowly pulling in your favourite colour. Imagine your favourite colour is now coming into your toes and into your feet. And this beautiful colour goes up your legs, passing through your knees, into your pelvis and your hips. Your favourite colour is filling up your digestive system and your belly. It fills your vital organs and continues into your lungs. This is a beautiful spiritual healing colour. And it fills you and lights you in such a beautiful way. It fills your heart and you notice how happy you're becoming whilst doing this. The colour goes across your shoulders and down each arm all the way to your fingertips. Your favourite colour is moving up your neck now. And as you feel it moving all through your body, it's relaxing every single muscle as it goes. It fills up your mouth, your ears, your nose, your eyes, and then quickly fills all the tiny areas of your brain, relaxing your mind. It moves all the way to the very top of your head where we began. Now, Notice how completely relaxed your body feels right now. I'm going to tell you something important and you'll deeply hear the words I have to say to you and it's going to affect your life for the better. And you're completely aware at every level of your mind and even through your body you may feel asleep. And these things I'm going to tell you build ability to relax, be accepting, break habits, learn new things and be happy. You want a life that is passionate and fulfilling. And you are fully capable of relaxing at any time you need to, allowing for life to come as it does, accepting the moments that are challenging, as well as those that are pushing you quickly towards your goals. When you feel a moment of tension, the way you instantly relax is to take a big deep breath, focus only on that breath when you do so. Allow nothing else to matter except your breath. And if you do this correctly, you will instantly feel more 
relaxed. If you need to take a few more deep breaths, relaxing you even further every time. This is the main key in changing your life for the better. Remembering that meditation and importantly in this instance, your breath is key. We know in life, if you desire to be fully happy, there's no option than to accept things the way they are. The changes you can make can only happen through yourself. Acceptance being the primary goal. Imagine that you're in some kind of argument and if you don't accept the situation as it is, you'll become angry and this clouds your ability to be happy. And when you get upset, it's difficult for you to think clearly and to accept the situation as it is. And do you see how being accepting of all situations and emotions allows us to be happy? And it's very beneficial when you're in a state of relaxation to focus on being happy. Relaxation is the key to anything. We know that once you fully relax, your mind is clear and your body is calm. With this newfound relaxation technique and the ability to accept these things as they come, you're able to learn to become a happier and more relaxed person in your life. You know that in order to be fully happy, you must find any possible ways to eliminate bad habits that keep you from being happy. And it's easy to notice your bad habits now. And when you do, you take a deep breath, relax in and accept that you've been presented with a moment where you can change. And each time that you're triggered towards a bad habit, this is an opportunity, an opportunity for you to learn to accept the situation as it is. In learning to accept the situation as it is, Remember, relaxation is your key and it allows you to make the necessary behavioural changes to move your life towards the better. And you'll do this effortlessly because it's so important to you. And the moment you make this change for the better, you will become a happier person. And lastly, the final step to achieving all these wonderful things from now on is you think, you walk, you act, and you feel generally and deeply relaxed. In those times when you need to accept the situation as it is, it's easy for you to do so, and you feel how happy you are. Your posture excludes confidence, and your head is held high. From now on, your actions with everyone you encounter are of complete acceptance. You genuinely accept things as they are, bringing your peace and relaxation. And each time you encounter a bad situation, you feel a deep knowing that this is an opportunity to just let go and accept it, a chance to be happy. And I want you to say to yourself with certainty, I can relax whenever I want by just deep breathing deeply. And I fully accept others and situations as they come. I notice when bad habits arise and will easily change them in order to learn new things and improve my life. All of these things I can accomplish. They will make me feel happy, full of joy and to have a life with clarity and purpose. And as you say that to yourself, notice how that feels. And be kind to yourself, knowing that you did such a good job in this meditation today. That you now have the ability in any situation, any emotion, and any habits that arise, just to stop. Take a deep breath in. Accept them and acknowledge them and let them go.
in our lives we have so many opportunities. But mindfulness, meditation and cultivation allows us to see these opportunities moment by moment. And it allows us to truly move forward in such a loving and meaningful way. And I want you to say to yourself again, I can relax whenever I want by breathing deeply. And I fully accept others and situations as they come. I notice when bad habits arise and will easily change them in order to learn new things and improve my life. I found this on the web. And notice how that feels. Again, you've done such a good job today. So let's come back to a wakeful awareness and bring back with you all that you've learned today. And I'm going to count you back from one to ten. And each time you hear the number, you remind yourself the relaxation is easy. It's just a deep breath. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Coming back in the room. And ten. Open your eyes, wiggle your fingers. So, as always, spirit is always around me and I should always remember to turn all my electrical equipment off but for some reason Alexa kicked in and uh, Siri kicked in it's just beautiful because it tells me that the spiritual energies are quite high and we're we're in the right zone so I hope you enjoyed that meditation it's quite a long one we've been sort of 20 nearly 25 minutes but it's so powerful to understand that we are in charge of our own destiny we can create a happy fun-filled life by accepting certain things, but increasing our ability to say, that's fine, that's okay. The situation where I am at the moment is fine. I'm grateful for the things that I've got and I'm happy. So it's Friday. Let's get that Friday feeling. Let's smile, let's be happy. Let's look forward to tomorrow, which is Saturday. And we put our hands on our hearts and we say, good day to you, Julian. I love you. Good day to you, Julian. I love you. Thank you for following me. I hope you have a lovely day. Please let you know your comments if you can subscribe to the channel. If you can also share and comment this so we can spread the word out. As I always say, it'd be lovely to get some more views and for more people to be able to take advantage of the wonderful thing that is mindfulness. Be love and give love. Have a lovely Friday. Take care. See you later. Bye-bye.